pale and incandescent, very young, ethereal creatures with a very sheer base and a very cold, icy blue wash on the eyes, highlighting right in the corner here. We're taking shimmer across the cheek, across the cupid's bow, and just slightly on the lip. The collection is quite dramatic in its colour. It's dark black, very dark red. And we've used as a total contrast to that like opposite pale, shimmery colour, it's pale, icy blue. So they feel quite young and clean amongst all the drama. This is based on my experience in Iceland with a beautiful dust light, which is kind of between dark and light. So it's lots of texture around it. And obviously I'm a great friend of a French painter called Soulage, and all his work is all about texture. So it's all about texture, a bit of color, but a really warm winter. So it's a dark winter collection. making hat. So what we do that this particular collection is something quite special that we actually combine the head, the headdress and the clothes and all kind of go into one. When you see it on the table well, you can understand what I'm talking about. So it's really almost like a blossom, you know, and uh, yeah something I just come across and I feel like trying it. You know. All my career is all about handcraft, so we are a very good uh, team of craft person who work with us all the time. So a lot of dresses, it takes maybe two or three weeks to construct it. With my, where I come from is that, you know, there is so much fashion in the marketplace now. I like to be able to do something people, you know, is that some come from my heart and soul, and some better they can treasure for one year to come. They're kind of winter color, you know, because usually I don't do many color. But at the same time, when you see, when you're just sitting in, in the kind of place like Iceland, and the, the light, the light changing, and you see a hint of color, they're color, but they're really dark and they're really rich. And I think why I try to put across in this collection. I see 1985, so nearly 30 years now. I mean, one of, this, one of the old men still around. I think it's very exciting. I think the British fashion is as good as it's ever been. And, it, and I'm, I, I'm almost jealous of the young people coming through. That is the support they have and among of the, the opportunity there. And uh, it's a wonderful time and it's, I'm grateful I'm still be part of that. I'm still motivated, yeah, because if I don't enjoy what I do, it's no point, you know. One day when I don't enjoy it, I may step down, but at the moment, I'm still loving what I do. I love women, <laughs> so I think it's important to make... Uh, beauty is a word I always use, because I think that it's enough tragedies in the world we're living in. So I was lucky to be a fashion designer and able to create beauty for people to enjoy and I always try to do that. Mm -hmm.